I enjoy I have taken like a 20 minute break to just stop crying after the previous episode. Today I'm going to be watching Star Wars or Rebels season 4 episode 11 at Doom which is Kanan's name and I don't know if that means that like my tears will have been well not for nothing because it was still an emotional and beautiful moment and horrific moment but my tears will have been like overreaction because he's okay or most likely if it's going to be like a farewell episode and I'm fucking miserable. Um, a reminder that you can find the unedited version of this reaction and all of my reactions to this wonderful show on my Patreon. Uh, well, I'm doing some in advance, the edited version one week in advance. And let's go. Okay, when they're at wreckage we're just gonna see him like climb out and he's totally fine, right? Throw a parade to celebrate this victory. Jesus Christ, you killed one man who is not dead because I refuse. I refuse, okay, I refuse, I refuse, I refuse, I refuse. We don't even need these scenes because nothing happened at all. <laughs> no! No, oh, I can't deal with this. Sabine? Sabine? They deserve to know rather than just see who's not there. <laughs> no, no, no! Kanan's gone. What do you mean, gone? <laughs> captured? No! He's gone. <laughs> they literally just took 20 minutes to stop crying. <laughs> That's the purest thing and it breaks my heart so much. <sighs> what was the point of me taking 20 minutes to stop crying? Mon Mothma won't commit more forces to Lothal. Not after this. General Sindula. Hey, <laughs> what do you think? They think she was just captured and tortured and then she lost the love of her life. I think she needs some time. She needs time. Well, we don't have time. Well, what should we do? Cry. Sweet boy, he loves you so much. Proud of you. There was nothing I could do. What are you doing, Wolf? So you're in tune with the force, sweet boy. Can you communicate with them somehow? What do you want from him? Do you really believe that holding a parade would hide the fact? She did. She's a moron. Why did I wait so long to tell him? He always knew. I just would be more time. He knew every second of every day. Just like you knew he loved you. <laughs> he would be alive. He said starting a war was a mistake. And he was right. No. He was right. And now he's gone. So many lives are gonna be saved in the long run. And it's my fault. You're right. No one deserves that honor. More than Kanan. <laughs> now that is interesting. Yeah, go home with the information. Don't do something reckless. Oh, don't do something reckless. You can't lose anyone else. Connecting to the Imperial Network in three, two. One. Okay, if they're just getting information, information is fine. If they get information, I can take that. I mean, we can even the score. They took Kanan from us. We taking something from them. If you take this creep, this guy, Only it's not gonna. Let it track us back to base. Let's use that to our advantage. It's not gonna hurt the Empire beyond, you know, a resource they can't use again. Kanan? I want that so much. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I thought that was a big snout. <laughs> you're saying you're Kanan? Kanan was reborn as a wolf? Jesus Christ, what is this technology? I can't see him. I just, I, I feel lost without my master. 
He was wise mm -hmm. and brave. Made you feel safe. He was there for me when. What does it mean? Christ. Please say she planted the bomb on him. She did. Jesus Christ. Oh, it was just a painting, not a bomb. Oh, yeah. This is. No, Kanan wouldn't want this. That's a sweet boy. Oh, still calls out for Kanan when he's scared. I think this is the best message we can send to the Empire right now. Hey, you set the home for Kanan, so he'll always be remembered as a part of my family. Yes, he you always know, will be. Despite all his misgivings about the rebellion. He always believed we could change things. Exactly. But yours was. The TIE Defender factories have shut down. We didn't fail, Hera. Kanan made sure of it. <laughs> he saved us all. To destroy us, and we have a chance. We can still beat them. And I know what our first mission is. Oh, my love. The Jedi Temple is in danger. And we're the only ones who can do anything about it. Okay, so this episode, you know, mildly, though it was still very traumatic, um, seeing Chopper comforting Hera was just everything, and just this little family grieving in their own ways. I still, like, there is still, even though I cannot stop crying, <laughs> for very long there is still that part of me that is in denial that is expecting king and is gonna rock up at some point and be like oh yes um i've been on a secret mission maybe he's just alive he's been on a secret mission for the wolves and then in a couple of weeks i'm gonna be cry laughing that would be nice but i'm i i, I, I... Denial, okay? Look, as far as I'm concerned, when the show is over, Kanan turned up and was like, hey, I was in this really secret mission and the Empire had to believe I was dead. I'm so sorry I did that to you. And then Hera will be like, slap him and then she'll kiss him and then it'll be fine. Um, that, that's how the show ends. After the show ends. The moment with Zep, a job and saw the shots are coming and Zep was just like, yeah, they're back. He didn't even cross his mind that they would have failed in the mission of getting Hera. It didn't even cross his mind that something could have gone wrong because they've always made it through scrapes before. It's so wrong. If Kanan, if Kanan is dead, isn't he? And it's just wrong. Like, this show didn't need to do that. We get the stakes already. Thank you very much. Um, but he died saving everybody and the mission was a success. <sighs> Ezra normally would have been more in tune with the wolves far quicker, but he was grief-stricken and lost. The idea that we have to go to the Jedi Temple first is very interesting, but it also ties very much into the whole there's a reason we've come here, there's a reason we've been drawn here, and I'm excited to see what that is. I'm glad Zeb and Sabine pulled themselves back before they did anything too reckless, because getting yourselves killed or hurt or captured doesn't avenge Kanan. Accidentally causing innocent lives lost doesn't avenge Kanan. Even killing the bad guy when you haven't defeated doesn't avenge Kanan. It's not what Kanan would have wanted. Um, I mean, yes, yeah, sending him back, I mean, shit that painted like that, sends a brilliant message to everybody who sees it, but at the same time, it does also mean that he's out there and able to cut, strike back in the future. But again, I mean, we don't really have the facilities to keep prisoners. So this episode was dealing a lot with the grief. Error, you know. We really watched her process everything. Go from, go through the like, it's all my fault. I pushed him to this, I forced him to this. Why didn't I tell him sooner? You know, you did tell him and he knew every single second otherwise. And Chopper was trying to comfort her as best he can. My Lord Chaos Gremlin is to pick his heart. Um, um, and then her reaching to the point of, even if he didn't initially think this rebellion was possible, he always believed we could do it. He believed in us was really beautiful and the way like you know you kind of saw her 
I think it's sad in a way that she isn't allowed any more moments to grieve, any more moments to process, but they are in the middle of a war, they are in the middle of a fight for their lives and for the lives of everybody else in the galaxy. They don't have the luxury of time to grieve, so Hera just took that time. She gave him this piece on her Calicori and he will always be remembered as a part of her family and it was beautiful and now I'm devastated. <sighs> so, yeah this show is devastating i i knew the stakes were raised and everything i still don't necessarily i don't like when shows kill characters off and i will say it every single time it happens i think it is unnecessary i think it is just trying to make you feel shock value emotions if you can make people think somebody is dead for a little bit and then bring them back it is far better but yes this show did it at least it wasn't in a stupid pointless way like shows often do i haven't fully processed it yet i don't know if i ever will i don't even know if i process what i saw in this episode yet I love this family and this team and I'm not going to be okay until that la the last member comes back. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> Reminder that you can find the unedited version of this reaction on my Patreon two weeks in advance, the edited version one week in advance and all my reactions to Rebels. And thank you so much for watching.